You guys are loving the El Salvador content, so I'm sharing my itinerary with you guys. Make sure you screenshot this and save this for later, and most importantly, have fun while you're out there. We took the earliest flight on Volaris and arrived in El Salvador at 5 a.m. From there, we picked up our car rental directly at the airport. If you guys are looking for car rental people, drop a comment. And we headed to Olocuita for breakfast. Olocuita was the first town to invent the pupusa, so if you're looking for pupusa heaven, definitely visit this place. Next, we headed to Los Chorros. Los Chorros is a natural water park that consists of four swimming pools. It is beautiful out here and it is perfect for families. This is a perfect spot to hang out and just beat the heat. We were finally able to check into our Airbnb and this is a small glimpse of it. We had private beach access, Pacific Ocean front views, mountain views, a private pool, the whole nine yards. For dinner, we went to Beto's restaurant. This place was recommended by the neighbors and it was stunning. Oceanfront views, we watched the sunset here and we ate delicious seafood. They are actually famously known for their seafood. This is some calamari. We had some fried oysters. Stuffed lobster and the drinks were so good. The next day we headed to Lago de Guatapeque where we will be having lunch at Las Palmeras which is a floating restaurant. It is so beautiful here. We did the boat ride and it took us around the entire lake. It also had this big blue slide where you can slide and go straight into the lake. This was very relaxing, we enjoyed it. And we also did jet skis which I highly recommend, it was super fun. It is now the third day and this is our rest day. We were gonna enjoy the Airbnb, be at the pool, and hang out at the beach. This is our Airbnb. We absolutely loved it. The kids enjoyed it. We had an infinity pool. We had a private beach. All you would hear are crashing waves and birds away from the hustle and bustle. Very relaxing. For dinner, we decided to cook at home and we fried some fresh fish that was literally just caught a few hours ago. This was our final day and we visited the pier at Surf City. And here you will also see fishermen selling the freshest wild caught seafood. Make sure to follow me for more El Salvador content. Hope you have fun out there.